the next thing I'm going to show you is uh, new objects um, panel. So we've got a create objects panel here. And so, you know, if you're going to uh, visualize your uh, new capture space, or let's say you're moving on location, you can very quickly create um, sets of um, volumes to visualize. And we've added this kind of create multiple feature here. So if I select this here, it will actually, when I go to create my object, it will create multiple copies of that object. So for example, let's say I know I'm going to have 10 cameras. I can just add the name in here and then click OK. And what Shogun Post is going to do is go and generate 10 uh, new cameras for you to position in your scene. Like so. And if we go to our selection panel here, here are our 10 cameras. So rather than having to script that, it's now done automatically for you. Um, one thing um, while I'm in this area that you might be aware of is we've added some functionality to make the selection tree easier to navigate. So if you hold down shift and expand a selection, it will actually expand the whole selection for you. And likewise, if I have a single selection and it's hidden, here, if I press F, it will zoom in to the uh, selection that I've made. So whether it's hidden or not, it still becomes visible. And the last thing to highlight is um, the ability to right click and choose select branch. So this is um, a nice benefit if you're, let's say I want to export my retargeting skeleton. All you have to do is select the parent object, right click and select branch. And then it will only select any of the children underneath that parent. And then the retarget skeleton is ready for export.